Now, unfortunately, we'll sometimes see, uh, because people want to write good English, we'll see sentences like, the rat is eaten. Mmm, tasty. Rat. Yeah. Now, that's a perfectly good sentence, but it leaves a very important uh, piece of information out. Who? Who ate the rat? An example of this would be, the file is saved. Where? What saved the file? You know? So, the pattern we want to use instead is cats eat rats. We don't have to use the past tense. We don't have to use any sort of present perfect. Just a very simple sentence structure, present tense, who does what to what object, okay? So it's following this pattern of subject, verb, object. This makes it super easy to translate and super easy to test, right? If you see the, the sentence, the file is saved, well, where? But if you see the sentence, you know, the system saves the file on the server, then the tester knows exactly what to look for. And also your user has a very clear idea of what's happening and what is doing it. It's not magic, okay?